oh god, is this turning into a different type of love story than I thought it was gonna be? Amazing. <laughs> Don't sneak up on me like that. I only have one eye. You scared me. I can't see through my peripherals. It's okay. You look cute when you're scared. You look cute when you're scared. That's something that a psychopath tells you. Oh my god, some new limited edition merch just dropped. We have new super comfortable yoga sets in both black and pink, as well as two new zip-up hoodies in both black and white, and everything glows in the dark. So make sure to click on my link in the description below to check them out. They are limited edition, so make sure to get them before they're gone. Hey guys, and welcome back to me reading some more gotcha stories from around the internet. And while trying to scour the hundreds of gotcha stories that I see on YouTube, and figuring out which one would make for the best Video. I thought back to the first gotcha story that I ever did, which was the one about the only girl in an all boys school. I was like, hmm. Are there any gotcha stories that are the reverse of that? Like having a boy in an all-girls school? And of course, yes there is. Multiple ones. But I found this one from Nana Plays that has about six parts to it, and it looks pretty decent, so we're gonna see what happens. Let's see how different it is for a boy in an all-girls school versus a girl in an all-boys school. And yeah, it starts off right in the middle of school. And I'm pretty sure whoever made this was picturing, like, a Zac Efron-looking gotcha kid, because that's what this reminds me of. And I'm guessing it's him and his sister because they look almost exactly alike. And his sister also looks like she's supposed to be like a super hot girl. So they just come from really good genes. And then we have this random fox girl who's missing an eye starting us off with the dialogue. So let's go. What's he doing here? Oh my god, a boy? But how? You're probably wondering why I'm in a girl's school. So let's start from the beginning. Why didn't you just start from the beginning at the beginning? That scene wasn't necessary. Kid, come here. <laughs> What a great mom. Kid, kid, come here. Oh my God, it's like bird box. Boy, girl, come here. Yes, mama. As you know, I will go to the kingdom and be a maid. Of course, as you know, as you know, that's what happens. Yes. We'll lose the house, but you guys are getting dorms. Yas. You'll have to go to your sister's school. Wh why? I feel like it's the same exact situation as the other gotcha story with the girl in an all-boys school. What? Why can't she go to my school? Your principal wouldn't agree with it. Okay. Now, off to school you go. Who's this cutie? Ugh, it's none of my business anyway. Amelia over there is thirsty as hell. She's like, oh my god, a boy. A boy, I must have him. I need to touch him. A boy. I'm her brother. Jace. Okay, let me tell you who you can and can't hang with hot stuff. So definitely not the people staring at you. <laughs> definitely not Amelia. <laughs> they are the losers of the school. And 10 million percent not to even make eye contact with the monster creature. Oh, are they talking about the little bell, the bell fox girl thing? That girl's cute. Oh, of course, out of all the girls, the one who looks like the youngest and looks like she's part animal. What's he doing? Hey. Ah! Don't sneak up on me like that! I only have one eye! You scared me! I can't see through my peripherals! Sorry, I'm not used to getting talked to. I'm a loner. It's okay. You look cute when you're scared. You look cute when you're scared? That's something that a psychopath tells you. Hey, you look real cute when you're scared. <laughs> How romantic. Th thank you? <laughs> no problem. See you later, cutie. Uh, uh. Uh, oh no, she fell for him, even though he's clearly a psychopath. Later that day, I can't believe you embarrassed me. Chill, I'ma play her like I did Mia. <laughs> what? Plus, your friend Nadia is way cuter than that monster. Oh my god, he's he's mean. Unless he's just covering. Good, here is your room. Your roommate is Nadia's sister, and your other roommate will be here soon. So enjoy. <laughs> Not you, my sister? Hey, you must be April. Oh my god, she's adorable. Yes, Jace, right? Jane, are you? You okay? Oh god, his other roommate is Jane. I'll be back. What's wrong? There was a cute boy who flirted with me for the first time, and then I found out he was going to play me. Oh, she must not know Jace is there. She heard me. I mean, who would want to date me? I'm blind in one eye. I would. Oh my god, I ship it. Jane and April, get together. I love it. I love it so much. Wh what? I like you, Jane. I mean, you're cute, nice, sweet. Oh god, is this turning into a different type of love story than I thought it was gonna be? Amazing. <laughs> and if he he didn't see that he don't deserve you. Forget I ever- Oh, oh! D Jane just got up and kissed her! Whoa. This story is going in a totally different direction than I had anticipated. I like you too. OMG! 
All right, the next day. Wakey, wakey, April. Good morning. What happened to your tail and your ears, girl? Morning. How about you get dressed and we go get makeovers? Sure. Oh my God, makeovers, yay. <laughs> yay. Oh, what a cute look for you, April. At the mall. Let's go to the hair store first. <laughs> the hair store. Hi, we would like to get our hair done. Okay, who's first? I wouldn't trust somebody whose hair looks like this to do your hair. Me. Okay, sit. Oh my God, what's gonna look like? Whoa, totally different hair. Pretty. Next. Done. Ooh, I like it. It's like Lizzie hair. <laughs> Thanks, here is the money at the clothes store. We're here. Hey, let's play a game. So you choose an outfit for me and I'll choose an outfit for you. I'm in. That was quick. Here, here. Meanwhile, with Jace. <laughs> Yeah, what happened to Jace? Supposed to center around him. I should tell Jane I'm sorry. A uh, note. Death. It just says death on it. <laughs> Damn, Jane took it hard. Hey, Jace, we left to have a makeover. I guess I will invite Mike over. What's up, Mike? Why does Mike have crazy eyelashes? Sup? So how's it been being surrounded by girls? Any cute? They all are. Let's sit. Talks, talks. Hee 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 hee. Oh, we look so good. You. Ch -ch -ch Jane? Oh, she knows Mike. Oh my god. Plot twist. What is happening? Oh, the tension. Oh no. Okay, I started a new episode and now it looks like Jane is a completely different character. Let's see, uh, let's see how they explain this. Hey, it's me, Jane. Welcome back. Well, things have changed. April and her sister with Isabella left. Bella is upset since they left. Jace is still the only boy. Me, Jace, and Mike started a band. <laughs> what? How much time has passed? Also, they didn't explain why she knew Mike. How does she know Mike? She's still dating April? I have so many questions. We are looking for someone to play the keys. Well, that's all I think is important. Hey, can I sing a song? Sure. Oh, they're jamming out. They're jamming out, sick. Bye guys, I better get back to school. Jace, you know where the spare key is. She's so cute. She's so- they both said it. She's mine! <laughs> Excuse me, where is music class? You do music? What do you play? Keyboard. Can you show me what you got? Sure! <laughs> oh my god, she's amazing. She's amazing. Wow. Guys, I found our new keyboard player. Maggie, come on out. She's also a super cute girl. You! Wait, why do people keep saying you and then it just keeps ending? So, Mike, you left me for Miss Purplehead? Oh, this is ex-girlfriend. Number one, I'm not his girlfriend. Number two, no one calls me Miss Purplehead. Also, where's April? Where's April? <laughs> what are we doing here? Oh my god, there's April! We're here meeting someone. Okay. April! Jane! Wait, are we- are they not together anymore? You know I can't be with you. We can only be friends. He's always watching. What? Hold on, I got a text. You can't talk to her either. Why? So I guess some stalker dude is telling her to stay away from April? I think you know why. And quit the stupid band. And you can't talk to Mike and Jace anymore. You can't do this. I can and I did. I hate you. That no way to talk. <laughs> I don't care if you're... Who is this? And why do they have so much pull with her? To tell her that she can't do certain things. Whatever. Just follow my rule or they're the ones to suffer. Oh, they're threatening to hurt the other people. Okay. This story has just escalated completely. Okay. Okay. Where are you going? Do you know why she did this? No. What are you doing here? Waiting for the new roomie. Hi, I'm Jane. I'm Nova, and this is Nora, my twin. Oh, you guys are cute. Oh, no, it's Bella. Wasn't she mean to me? She used to be mean to me. I look good now, though, girl. Hi! Who's that? That's Bella. Why'd she leave? What? I want to say sorry for everything I ever said. It's fine. I know why you did it. You do? You liked April's sister, so you only bullied me to please her. Now that she's gone, you grew feelings for me. So you're saying sorry, am I right? Well, I guess you can say that. So, I thought there was one more episode, but apparently there's not. This one's episode 5, but they labeled it episode 6. So, yeah. It just ended with no ending. There's just somebody telling her not to be with April and not to have friends. I just, I just, I don't know what I just read. But as always, I'm gonna upload it so that you guys have to sit through what I just sat through. And melt your own brains. Yay. Also, as always, if you made it this far in the video, then make sure to leave a like before you go. For every like I get, my brain brain is saved a little bit. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. I put out new videos almost every single day. And as always, I will see you guys soon.